what my bill basically says is that if the Public Service Commission finds that the region is economically distressed as defined by federal law, then the PSC cannot allow any return on investment that exceeds 6% profit. Because under the law, you can't say they're not entitled to a profit. But I think that there is a substantial case that can be made that if you have an area that is in um, an economically distressed situation where you have a lot of people out of work, where you've had a lot of people having to leave the region, and a large number of people on fixed income, it is unconscionable for a, an investor-owned utility to be able to recover a 0.7% or 10% profit when many people are struggling to even make ends meet. We're looking for every way we can. I know we just, uh, through the Public Service Commission's uh, work uh, just a few weeks ago, uh, they, uh, with the tax break that, or the tax uh, reform that came out of Washington, we were able to reduce by over 4%. I know people don't think that this last bill, they had a 4% reduction, but it would have actually been 4% higher. Uh, but this bill will give an even greater reduction, and we just simply have to get power bills under control there uh, within a region. It's just, uh, it's, it's, it's just a sad time. Uh, when people are placed in that situation to decide whether to pay for electricity uh, or to uh, pay for food.